Hey, Sean here from speedcubeview.com. This video is to go over notation for scrambling a cube as well as reading algorithms. This is a pretty basic part of cubing but can be very confusing for beginning cubers. There are six common letters that talk about which face to turn. F for front, B for back, U for up, D for down, R for right, and L for left. Each letter means turning that face 90 degrees. The letter with an apostrophe after it would be turning it the opposite way and pronounced instead of U as U prime. Now the faces are turned clockwise as if you're looking at the face head on. So a U move would be this. F is this, R this, because you can see what it's like if you're looking at it from that side, L is this. Here is where things really get confusing though. B is this, because that is clockwise if you're looking at it head on from the back, and a D move is this. What can be most confusing about it is that a B move looks opposite an F move, or you could say that F spins the same way as B prime. Now what I did was learn what finger to use to move each face so that F and U are done with my right hand and D and B are done with my left. The opposite then would be true for B prime and D prime done with my right hand and U prime and F prime move with my left hand. Notation with the two following the letter means that the face will rotate 180 degrees. There is notation to turn the middle parts of the cube. M is for the middle and copies the direction of L. So since L and L prime is this, M is this and M prime is this. E you can think of as the equator, it moves the same way the D face does, in D and D prime, E and E prime. Lastly we have S for the side of the cube, and it moves the same as the front face. F and F prime look like S and S prime. There's also notation for rotating the entire cube around. These are noted with lowercase letters. You don't see this for scrambles, but for algorithms they do show up. Y shows up most often and copies the same rotation as the U face does. Y means the whole cube rotates 90 degrees clockwise. X copies the R side by moving the cube up or down, and Z spins the cube in the same direction the front face does. Finally, there is notation to move more than one layer at once. This is either noted by a lowercase letter or with a W following the letter. For example, R and R prime is this, while lowercase R and R prime, or RW and RW prime, is this. You will not see this for scrambles for 3x3 cubes, but you will for 3x3 algorithms and scrambles for 4x4 and 5x5. I hope that was clear enough. When I was starting out, I did better just watching a video of someone doing certain algorithms than I did reading notation. Thank you for watching. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comment section below. Please like and subscribe for more content like this, and as always, stop by speedcubeview.com for more news and reviews.